long before humans ever walked the earth, the skies belong to giants, not dinosaurs, not birds, but insects. Meet Meganeura, the dragonfly of nightmares. Over 300 million years ago, during the Carboniferous period, Meganeura ruled the air. With wings stretching up to 30 inches, nearly the size of a modern hawk, it was one of the largest insects to ever live. At first glance, it looked like today's dragonfly, but this was no ordinary bug. Its huge compound eyes could spot prey from far away, and its powerful jaws made quick work of smaller insects. Scientists believe Meganeura was a fierce predator. It hunted beetles, other flying insects, and maybe even small amphibians. For creatures of its time, it was the ultimate aerial hunter. But how could an insect grow so massive? The answer lies in the air itself. Back then, oxygen levels were much higher than today, nearly 35% compared to our 21%. This oxygen-rich atmosphere allowed insects to breathe more efficiently and to grow to enormous sizes. The world of Meganeura was a humid, swampy jungle filled with towering ferns and giant bugs. Imagine walking there, dragonflies the size of eagles buzzing overhead, millipedes longer than a car crawling on the ground. A truly alien Earth. But like all giants, its reign didn't last. As oxygen levels dropped and climates changed, Meganeura vanished. No insect since has ever reached its incredible size. Today, the dragonflies we know are just tiny reminders of this ancient predator. The skies no longer belong to Meganeura, but its story reminds us of a time when insects were kings of the air. Meganeura, the giant dragonfly of prehistoric skies. Subscribe for more amazing stories from the past.